Cigarette smoking is highly injurious to health. Please quit before it's too late or else be ready to go bankrupt. Well, I'm so proud you asked that question, little kitty. Hey friends, so in today's episode, let me explain the dire consequences of smoking and answer a literally life-saving question. Why is smoking bad for you? Zoom in. I'm sure you must have seen warning signs for smoking almost everywhere, including the box of cigarettes. It is indeed the worst thing we can do to our body, especially at an early age. Although not all students smoke, however, it is estimated that nearly 3,200 kids and teens start smoking every day, which is still a big concern for us. These naive kids are unaware of smoking's effect on their health and could attract this habit under peer pressure to look cool out of curiosity or rebel against the adult's advice of staying away from smoking, whatever the reasons for smoking could be. But one thing is common and that is smoking can damage your body in the worst way possible. How? Let me explain. You see, when someone smokes, with each inhalation, more than 5,000 harmful chemical substances enter the consumer's body, beginning with your teeth. The tar present in smoke starts to coat the teeth and gums, doubling the risk of oral diseases like sensitivity and tooth decay. And when the smoke reaches your nose, it starts to destroy the nerve endings located in it, resulting in loss of smell. And as the smoke goes inside the airways and lungs, it starts to damage your cilia, a thin hair-like structure responsible for keeping our airways clean, and then enters into the air sacs to contaminate it. This increases the chances of infections and other chronic diseases like emphysema and bronchitis. Not only that, the toxic gas like carbon monoxide generated into air sacs breaks out of it and enters our bloodstream and binds with hemoglobin and replaces the oxygen needed by the body. And hence, the consumer can experience shortness of breath leading to asthma. Meanwhile, the blood carries nicotine to the brain releasing feel-good chemicals like dopamine and endorphins, which are responsible for making smoking a destructive addiction. Nicotine and other chemicals can also constrict blood vessels and restrict blood flow. This leads to thickening of blood vessel walls and increases the stickiness of the blood platelets, leading to the formation of blood clots resulting in stroke or heart attack. And the worst part, many harmful chemicals present in the smoke can damage your DNA and disrupt the repairing process leading to many forms of incurable cancer which in most cases, according to statistics, are fatal. But here is good news my friends. If someone decides to quit smoking today, your body will start to recover within 20 minutes and slowly in the next 15 years, your heart will be as healthy as a non-smoker. Sure, quitting smoking will not be an easy task, but with the help of nicotine gums and other facilities, brave souls can win this battle for themselves and their loved ones. Trivia time! Did you know smoking can shorten your life by 10 years or more? Also, smoking can cause eye disease, 
weakening of bones, skin diseases, yellow teeth, bad breath, etc. Hope you learned something vital today. Make sure to be brave and say no to smoking. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. What's this smell? <coughs> Never mind.